anti-surf advisory in effect right now for southern New England. Hurricane Katia is churning up local waters, creating large swells and dangerous riptides. Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Scherer has the details in Narragansett with the South County Mobile Newsroom. The people here at Scarborough Beach are desperately seeking sunshine after three days of rain. As you can see, the waves are pretty big, and with lifeguards officially off duty for the season, many are aware of the danger of the rough surf. Surfers, swimmers, and beach lovers couldn't resist the eight-foot waves and sunshine at Scarborough State Beach despite the rough surf and riptides from Hurricane Katia. It's a great day to be here. You know, sun's out. Just happy to be here. It's not, too, it's not too bad out there. Are you a strong swimmer? Pretty good. The Department of Environmental Management is urging all residents to exercise caution this weekend as Katia travels past the New England coast. The DEM strongly recommends people stay out of the water until the surf calms down. Do you know what to do if you get caught up in a riptide? Uh, swim for dear help. <laughs> no, no, no. That's not what you do. You have to swim to the side. These ladies from Ireland and South Carolina say the ocean is beautiful to look at. But I'm from Myrtle Beach, so these waves are much larger than we have down there. We're from Dublin, so it wouldn't get as big a surf as like this at home, no way. It's, it's way the waves are huge today compared to the last few days. All state beaches are officially closed for the season. So if you'd like more information about riptides and how to stay safe, you can check it all out at our website at WPRI.com. With the South County Mobile Newsroom, Marilyn Shera, Eyewitness News.